One day, Chibiko slept for so long that when he woke up, it was already getting dark outside again. Oh dear, he thought to himself. I'm wide awake and it's almost bedtime again. What should I do? Chibiko wasn't used to being up so late. Daytime was for being awake and nighttime was for sleeping. Whatever did people do during nighttime anyway? He thought about this for a moment and then it hit him. People watch movies in their homes at nighttime. At least, he thought that was one thing that they might do. And so, Chibiko got a bowl of popcorn and sat himself down in front of his television with his remote in hand so that he could see what movies there were to watch. There were funny movies, there were cartoons, and there were romantic movies. There were also action movies. Chibiko imagined what it might be like to be a kung fu master. Sad movies, and movies about real life. There were also scary movies. Ah, Chibiko thought, scary movies are what people watch late at night. I'll watch a scary movie. And so, Chibiko chose a scary movie, sat back, and started to eat his popcorn. The movie was very scary. And after a while, Chibiko could swear that he saw a spider creeping towards him from the corner of the room. Chibiko thought that he should get up from his chair and go to another room. But when he tried to, he found that he was too scared to move. The shadowy object got closer and closer and closer. And then, it said, Hello! Gah! Chibiko started to shriek, but then he paused. He had been expecting a roar, or an evil laugh, or maybe something like the sound of nails on a chalkboard. Instead, he had heard a simple hello. It was a friendly sounding hello too. It even sounded a little bit shy, like maybe it was also scared. Chibiko opened his eyes. Hello, the thing said again. My name is Danny. I live in the treehouse next door. Danny reached out a thin arm and Chibiko shook his hand. Nice to meet you, he said. Would you like to watch this movie with me? I think we'd both feel braver if we had a friend to watch with. And so, thanks to a scary movie, Chibiko became friends with a little triangle that had been hiding near his home. <laughs> 